Welcome back, everybody, to Red Dead Redemption. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to go ahead and get back to some questions. So if you missed the last episode, uh, we went out and did some hunting. Uh, we killed we killed a buck deer. We killed a, an antelope or a pronghorn, uh, three turkey toms, and we got eaten by a cougar. <laughs> so it was, it was pretty crazy. Uh, but we had a good time and um, went down by the river, checked some things out, gotten into a little bit of a scuffle with some O'Driscolls. Uh, but I ran away like a chicken because there was four of them and one of me. Uh, anyway, and uh, so what we're going to do in this episode is we're going to go talk to Uncle and start uh, doing some more questing. So let's go ahead and do it. Uncle is just right on over here. I'm not even sure if I know who Uncle is, but we're going to find out real quick, aren't we? Oh, he's asleep. Oh, oh. Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Do you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out? <laughs> sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. You gonna take the old man into town? You take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment to civilization. <laughs> Ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. Yep. Okay, let's do this. I, Uncle, I think we saw Uncle in Pearson's shack uh, up in the old mining town, but I didn't know that's what his name was. He has some kind of history with Arthur, but I'm, I don't know what the story is behind that. Maybe we'll find out. Ladies, sing us a song. Over there. I um, thought you wanted to head into town. Yes, but this won't take long. Look at the poor fella. Go on. He's an old man. All right. Come on. One of you. Lumbago, really. <laughs> you all right there, friend? Oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? Um, yeah, I guess sure, we'll help him. No problem. Calm Back. the escape to us. Hey, it's the white one over there. I have no idea how to do this. Hopefully the game shows us how. Easy, boy. Agitated horses need to be calm before you can approach them. When near, lock on with right mouse and G. Okay. We actually did do this earlier now that I think about it. Arthur. 
Whoa, easy. Let's see it, Arthur. Easy there. Whoa. There we go. Look at us and our bad horse calming self here. <laughs> it takes a big dump. Okay, we did our good deed for the day. The girls like like that I did that. Gentlemen, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. All right, there we go. I get, gained us a little bit of honor. Come on, let's go. To Valentine. <laughs> <laughs> You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. <laughs> and you have it, your pulse bold lizard. Lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. <laughs> this looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Okay. Take a good look around, ladies. Let's see what we got here. It's our first town we've been to so far. Go left here, down the main street. Chair's always on the right. Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Ooh, Heaven bounties. forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> I might do some bounties. That sounds like yes. fun. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. Yeah. Something else. That's it. Get out of the way! What the hell is this about? <laughs> You're in the way, you dumbass. Okay, here we go. All right, here we are, just like I said, cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're going to do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. <laughs> okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. <laughs> no. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm, then rats with the plague, then you. <laughs> Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. English Imperial. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Pardon Always me. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? 
You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Let me know if you have any questions, fellers. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Okay. Um, do you, does this guy have a fishing pole? Here, let's talk to the shopkeeper. You not getting anything, Arthur? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. We got forty-eight dollars. Um. Okay. So let's do. Select. So, you're actually buying for once. Wait a minute. You what? feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. What do you reckon? The lamb or the sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. I don't know what the smell is. <laughs> well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. He sold out of cigars. You know what? We have a bunch of cigars. We gotta sell them some. Okay, how do I? Um. Oh, never mind. I see. Can use the arrow keys or the mouse to select. All done. Gotcha. Thank you kindly. Okay, let's go back ah, this, this way. This should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. That should do us. Let's go wait for them outside. That's what I want to look at. Okay. Select. All right, we got arrows. Herbivore bait. Cover scent. There's a lure. Predator bait. Do not be cruel to your horses. Horse reviver, horse stimulant. I didn't see any fishing poles. Coffee percolator, gun oil, lake lure, arrows. That's all there is. There's no fishing pole. Oh. Cocaine gum? Yeah, see, that's going back the other direction. Okay, we got cartridges. So we get five arrows for 50 cents. Well, we have 22 arrows, so I think we're okay on that for now. Coffee percolator. Oh, we need we need one of those because I tried to make coffee earlier and it said I didn't have a percolator. You know what else we need is a I think it's like a leather working kit or something for crafting. So let's um live crickets. How come the it has a red padlock on it? Ten of five live crickets, excellent for attracting medium sized river fish. Is it because I don't have a fishing pole? Maybe, probably. That's my guess. All right. Um, let's buy this. That was kind of expensive, but we have some stuff to sell too. I've got one gun oil, uh, but that's not too expensive. Let's buy one of those too. Okay. I'm not gonna get any bait or anything like that until we actually have a fishing pole. Horse medicine, potent horse medicine. I don't think we need any of that right now. Um, all right, so we'll, well, let's, let's go back, and I want, uh, where do I, where would I find a leather working kit? On provisions, maybe? Yeah, see, this is just going to be more like groceries. Horse brush. Oh, is it? Okay, okay, good to know. So I, I, we have to do a quest before we can start fishing. Gotcha. You guys are saying buy a horse brush? Okay, so let's go there. Okay, and then let's find the horse brush. Wait. This, this is all it shows for horses. Probably isn't here because this looks like human clothing. We've got gloves. Oh, we have to get it from the stable. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. All right. 
Well, um, let's go ahead and back on out of here. That's kind of neat how that works, though, for buying stuff. Um, now, if we want to sell things to him, do we just talk? Oh, right. Okay. Okay. Let's let's make a little bit of, of bank here. So, um, he's got he's out of cigars. So let's sell. Um, seventy five cents. We'll sell that. We'll, we'll keep one of them. Okay, what's that? Gun oil. No, we just bought that. What else do we have that we could sell? Oh, I've got a bunch of jewelry that I've looted that I don't really think I need. Yeah. So let's sell this to him. Oh, he doesn't want it. Do I have to find like a jeweler or something for that? So it looks like he'll only buy like groceries, grocery types of items. What's this? Uh, what's this? Assorted salted offal. Oh, we got that uh, from the quest earlier. Yeah, here, let's sell that to him. <laughs> Supposed to be gross. I don't even know what exactly that is. That's our camp. No, we don't want to sell that. Well, he doesn't, he won't buy it anyway. Still sell hunting stuff to butchers. Okay. All right. Well, I guess that's all we can sell to him then. Um, what about what what about jewelry? Where would we sell that? Is there an actual you know jeweler jewelry guy or a watch, you know, person or something like that? You know, this is cool, man, because you can even like just go up to the shelves and and look at stuff too and buy it. So you don't have to just do the catalog. That is so neat. This game is like super immersive, you guys. Sweet corn. Premium cigarettes. What does he got over here? There's some candy. We could buy a piece of candy for Marston's boy. Herbivore bait. Escape the law by riding a donkey? Okay, cool. All right, well, let's go um, Let's go check out some more places here. Oh, he had lanterns. We need a lantern because I don't oh, know what happened to him. Here's your good health, sir. <laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. Oh, it's is that what it is? Okay. Else, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. <laughs> Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? what? I snuck into this fancy house, acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out near New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Uh-oh. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly. Huh? You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me. Get off of me. I've been looking too long. I got you now. Huh? Get your hands off mm. her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> or what exactly? You want to find out? 
You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you. Go right away now. with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. You're welcome, ma'am. Uncle! Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. Before we do that, though, I want to see if we can go back in here and buy a lantern. Oh, what happened? Oh, shit. Is it one of those things where you have to... Oh. Okay. Well, I guess once we get started with these missions, we, we got to see them through. Uncle! Look after her. I'm going to go see about Karen in the hotel. Okay, so we got to go this way. Can I help you, sir? I'm trying to help people. I, I do all I can manage. Are you doing all you can? Huh? A bath, perhaps? <laughs> no, I took Use a swim in the river after the cougar ate me. All right. I hear a woman calling out all night. That's oh. no good for anyone. Sir? We just go up and look for just the way it is. Guess so. We don't have access to our weapons, huh? Okay. <laughs> we got our binoculars out. We're going to cold cock somebody with the binoculars. No trouble now, please. My middle name is Trouble. All right, let's check this room first. There's someone out on the balcony there. Okay, guess we're not supposed to go that way. I just got his money. Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just men. But wow, she got banged up a bit, huh? Stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. Uh, personal space. Okay. So we got a possible lead on the bank and a possible lead on a train robbery. I hope uh, everything's okay up there. Just fine and dandy. After you. <laughs> this isn't one of those ladies first situations. There's just more rooms back here. Okay, I just wanted to look. Saints Hotel. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched uh, me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, then. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Uh oh. Hey, no, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Cool. Get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Whose uh, horse is this? Go. 
Let's burn it. You stay away from me. Where'd Get he go? Back here, right now. Call out for him. <laughs> Holy shit, that was bad. <laughs> oh, did he go over the cliff? Oh, man. Poor horse. <laughs> oh, that was hilarious. Why are you telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now, please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now, please pull me up. Please. I can't hold hmm. on much longer. Oh, what the hell? We'll help him out. I'm probably going to regret this. All right. Come on. I can't believe we hit that tree. <laughs> oh, jeez. That was you terrible. You okay, partner? No. No, I am not. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Jimmy Brooks. I think it's best for both of us. If we pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh... Here. You want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Oh. That's very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. I kill people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I never saw you. Not, not now, not, not never. I think we have an understanding? Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. I haven't. Not, not one lick. Not <laughs> one sense in this year old mind. Come on. Come on. You have a nice day now, sir. Horse blipped with his temporary horse. Okay, here. Yeah. Let's look at this. Oh, okay. So we... We didn't return the lost wagon horse to... Okay, so we did that, but we didn't find Karen within 45 seconds. All right. The, the, you know, the thing about this is it doesn't tell you what these objectives are until it's over. And I know you can go back and do them again, of course, but, I mean, how was I supposed to know I was supposed to do all that? You know what I'm saying? Not a big deal, though. Oh, we got a new herb here. That pin's good money. See, here's the thing. Um, I could see myself playing this game again. And so I think what I'm going to do, I think, I haven't made this decision for sure yet, but I think I'm going to make Arthur a good character the first time through, and then, you know, if I play through it again, then maybe we'll have him be like an evil character. So right now, for role-playing purposes, Arthur wants to, uh, he wants to kind of change his ways. Oh. But, you know, obviously he's not going to be able to do that overnight. So we're, we still have some yep. trains to rob. <laughs> All right, let's go home and or back to town, I should say. Man, this poor horse, man. I think I gave it a concussion. Let's take a look at our map here. Yep, that's the way we need to go. 
Oh, I guess Valentine's right here. I thought it, we had gone further than this. This is your horse? Here's your horse back, friend. Oh, you really were just borrowing it. Yep, Appreciate that's all I was doing. Come on, ladies. This sirloin will put a smile on your man's face, guaranteed. Hello there. Let's see what we can sell this guy. Okay, I want to keep that stuff for um, for crafting. What do you got that we can possibly buy? I don't know, man. With all the hunting we can do, I don't really see myself spending money on meat. It doesn't make a lot of sense. Okay. Oh, me too. <laughs> I hit that tree so hard. <laughs> okay. What am I supposed to do? Find my companions, I guess? I'll bet they're in the saloon. Oh, let's do what Dan said. Let's go look, look behind some of these places. Can we use a uh, eagle eye for anything? That's not lootable. They're building a new, a new shop or whatever right there. Are you just talking about like for completing the whole game, you mean? Hello? Amos Levi Blacks. Ooh, Howdy. I wonder if we'll find a, a leather working kid over here. The main reason I'm doing this is, is just, just to enjoy the story anyway. So the achievements are kind of fun, but they're not the most important thing to me kind of thing, you know? He's not the blacksmith. Watch it. Easy. Where's the where's the guy that I buy stuff from? Must be inside. I guess we're not going through that way. Look at the hay on the ground. That looks like real hay. Howdy, fellas. Hello. <laughs> One thing I don't like is Arthur either walks really slow or he runs. We need like an in-between speed. Okay, so how come I can't interact with a, a blacksmith vendor here? What am I doing wrong? Whoa, that horse just appeared out of nowhere. Oh, really? Oh, that is cool. So in the chat, uh, they were saying when I come back to town later, that building will actually be built. Hey, is that Marston over there? No, that's not Marson. Hey, mister. Hey. Howdy. Howdy, partner. Oh, that's cool, man. Don't tell me what it is. So that way when we come back, it can be a surprise. Howdy, friend. Welcome. All right. So, yeah, we sell the pelts to him. 
we'll start doing that um, with the hunting that we do. Thank you for your help. Okay, let's go back around this way. Okay, I'm not seeing anything here. Let's go down into the backyard and see if there's anything. Oh, that's the shitter. <laughs> Thought something smelled bad back here. see anything up here whoa see there lips indicate optional stranger mission speak to the stranger in the area behind the stand oh okay or behind the strand rather all right well let's go ahead and uh next time i come to town i'll look around some more but i want to spend a lot of time doing that So I think we're going to probably find our friends. Get moving, will you? Excuse me. In here. Yeah, they're in there. Oh, that's a squalo. Arthur, Arthur, come here. Come here. Come over here. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. Boy, well, you just a toughest teak mountain man. Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. <laughs> yes, he's a pussy cat. <laughs> That's all worth her. Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. <laughs> Dude, that was kind of mean. Well, I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man. I dread to think about it. Hey, hey, hey. hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it easy, Are you about pal. to kiss that guy Take or punch him? Huh? Oh, oh, and we have our <laughs> answer. Let me hear you. I'm just through these bastards. Oh, come on. We can handle these fools. You wish you never stepped foot. Is there a way to block? Oh, right. That's not in a very good spot to... That is a terrible key placement. F to punch and R to block. I might have to look into changing that. Help defeat the brawlers. Come on, Arthur, hit someone. I just did. What the hell's going on down here? Tommy, stay out of this. Come here, you little greaser. No. Yeah, you hit like I did. Come on, pretty boy. <laughs> pretty boy, you're kidding me. 
Really, boy? You're going down in the mud. Do not like these key placements. Oh shit. Oh nice. Hey, come on, stop that. Stop, stop. Please. Whew. Please. Man, my arm starts. Stop. Come soon. <laughs> You won the fight already, surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? <laughs> no business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Sir, sir, you all right? Man, that was a uh, quite Making the brawl. New friends again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. Oh, <laughs> well. I thought you'd gone to New York. I know. <laughs> and miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always... A pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him. Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah. <laughs> Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. He's the one that started it, old Bill. I am a mess. Whew. Okay. Oh, hey, look at that. We got a gold. A gold thing. Save Javier within 15 seconds. Defeat Tommy within 1 minute and 30 seconds. Woohoo! We did it. <laughs> no, I'm not going to replay that. <laughs> Here's what I am going to do, though. Um, I'm going to go here. I have a, my cursor's not showing up on my screen. Well, it's showing up on that screen, but not on my game screen. Uh, let's go to controls, keyboard and mouse, uh, key mapping. What? I have to look on my, on OBS to see where I'm clicking because it's, uh, okay. So I would like my punching keys to be on my, right hand on my mouse if it'll let me do that so uh, let's see run context action two okay so f context action two so i guess it would be these two right that i would need to change so remap input enter so we'll do mouse button five for that and Mouse button six for that. No, actually, you know what? I want to do that the other way around. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then this one will make four or well, mouse button five. Okay. That'll make it a lot easier for me because I, I don't know. I just had a little bit of trouble with R and F being right over one another for blocking and punching. I, I eventually figured it out, but this will be a little more comfortable. All right. Let's go ahead and escape out of there. Multiple missions are available in camp. These are shown as uh, the camp on the radar. Okay. So let's see. Where are we at here? All right. Yeah. All right, guys. I'm going to have to go ahead and wrap things up because i got to go eat dinner. Uh, so thanks very much for hanging out on the stream, guys. Really appreciate it. And uh, for those of you on YouTube, we'll, uh, can, uh, probably what I'll do is I'll go back to camp um, and, you know, get cleaned up, I guess, or whatever, and then we'll take another mission uh, when we start the next episode. So thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video, but remember not to give me any spoilers uh, in the comments. We'll catch you guys next time. Bye-bye.